brand new. Crazy thing is the owner of the gym, well, he owns the franchise, of course. Okay. Uh, the fucking, he was my first manager in MMA. Oh, yeah? When I went pro, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's dope. Hey. Yeah. We're here at the UFC gym in Oceanside, about to train with uh, Joey and Hans. I don't know what we're about to do, some kind of MMA stuff, so, you know, we got to kick it off with the dead game, though, dog. It's mandatory right here. Mando. Salute. Oh, bad dude, Hans. What's up, big Striking stuff, but I feel like uh, we we should do something like that. Should that that'll be dope. Okay. I was gonna say I was gonna say kind of have Joey walk through some bare knuckle shit. Oh, I'd be tight. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. Like, he's undefeated in bare, you're undefeated in bare knuckle. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So so I, I'll I'll try it. Yeah. But usually like we don't like doing this because like if you're putting. That's a bad dude right there. It actually tastes really good. It tastes bomb, huh? Yeah. Just go back and I'll, I'll go for football. You know what I mean? And I'll go for shit that, like, I know that. Joey, you know? come here. So, Joey, like, when he first started, he was he was on a tear and he like he beat everybody, right? Yeah. But in the UFC or just so so so, so, so so Joey started started you know normal route. Everybody starts the same route. He, he starts local shows, Total Combat from Total Combat, King of the Cage, Gladiator Challenge, all the locals, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you get you get the call up to like the Bellators and like the, the, like right before the UFC. Right. And Joey got the call up to the UFC and he had to fight. I mean, one of the most legit jiu-jitsu guys at the time, Always Gracie. Oh shit! Full Gracie. The OG? No, no, Holus, not Holus. Oh, 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 okay, okay. And he got brought in to lose. Super late, everything. Like, just it was one of those like seven day notice. It, it was not. He was not brought in to win this fight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not, did, not only did Joey beat the fucking brakes off this dude. He fucking made him tap to fucking, to fucking, he was on his, he rolled him over and fucking, blah, blah, and fucking boxed his ears in. It's pretty amazing. And so, Joey got known for taking fights like that. And, I mean, I didn't like any of the times he did it. I was always like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, dude, dude, stop doing this. Like, right, right. But he always, he was just game. So, like, no, so he, fought, he fought, he fought, he fought, he he fought Rampage. He fought fucking, oh, yeah. he fucked Matt Neutrino. All of them was like, it was none of these were like super long camps. It was just like, hey, we need someone to fight. They called Joey. He was like, all right. Damn. You know, how was Steve Bay was a camp though, right? Or no? Oh, yeah, yeah. Steve Bay was a camp. Um, Rampage was not though. Rampage was another 10 day notice. How was that? So I, 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 I don't like talking about it because I love Rampage now. He's, he's like, he's the homie, but fuck yeah. that guy. He's like, fuck that guy. It was kind of lame. He made yeah. a good shot right at the bell, and I felt I fell to all fours. And I get up, then I heard the bell. I get up, and then the doctors start coming. And I'm like, "What the fuck?" I'm right about to lose my shit. I, my coach, uh, Eric, he's like, "Joey, you can't do anything. Relax. You can't do anything. Fucking." They shut it. They shut the like, Fuck yeah, they stopped it. Literally at 4:59. Yeah. Fucking dag murder. You know, it is really the quick Oh yeah. No, yeah, that's what, I mean, I don't know too much, like you just said, uh, you, you gave me the rundown, but what I've seen already, like, you just game, homie. That's, that's what I, just from your pictures and everything, you just look no, there's, game, homie. No, there's a lot of guys I've dealt with that, like, they're just like, uh, uh, it's not enough time for a fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, and he's the opposite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. the opposite. He's like, we're telling him, whoa, 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 and he's like, yeah. let's go, you know, and, it, yeah, and it's, yeah. it, he's always been okay. like that, you know, and that's the thing is that, like, you know, a lot of people don't realize like how how this game is is that you're one fight away from like getting clipped. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And when yeah. you risk it Never like that, know. when you're risking it, like, hey, fuck it, I'll just fucking fight. I'm like, that's one of those things that like that you got it. Like, you got to realize that there are fighters that fucking fight because they like to fight. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, there yeah, are yeah. fighters that just want to fight because it's a career and they want to be a fighter. You know. Yeah. And that's the difference is that like. I've always fucked the guys that like are into it, like they yeah, really yeah, want yeah, it, you yeah. know. And that's and that's the thing is that Joey's been like into it since day one. Like when when Bare Knuckles started, he was like oh, right there, crazy. Bro. Yeah, and that's like that's crazy. And that's not like that's a, whole, that's a whole different level, man. Like I'm just I'm, that shit takes balls right there. Yeah, man, you're 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 yeah. fighting. 
bare knuckle. And yeah. Remember, this is not like so. What happens? What people don't get is that, and what I was saying, like you have to hit different yeah. because if you're going in there and you're going to fucking knock somebody out and you hit them right here, your hand explodes, right? Your hand fucking blow. This happens. Your hand's exploded now. You're just fighting like this. You're you're not. They're not stopping the fight. So you have one fucking hand now, and he's got two, and your face is gonna get it fucked up. <laughs> and is, uh, can you go to the ground with that no. too? Oh, no, no, it's just, no, no, it's no. pure boxing. It's oh, just boxing. Shit. It's a bare knuckle boxing fight. That's it. It's old Damn. school. Back in the days of John Sullivan. Yeah. Like old school shit. Yeah. Crazy. Here, come, come, come close. Show him your scars. I got a few. Explain. Show him like what happened on someone. Like these two right here. First ones happened happened right right in the fourth round of the uh, my first fight with Tony Lopez. I was doing really good, and literally probably like 10 seconds left in the fourth round. It was only a five round fight. Boom! I got hit, and immediately it's a, it's a crazy feeling. You feel the fucking cold wind on your skull. It's like it's totally different. It's like what? Well, here we go. We got another round to do it. And then this really big ugly one right here happened in the semifinals of the tournament against Arnold Adams who was the champ for a while, who just lost to Chase Sherman. And uh, Chase Sherman's actually who I have my eye on. We're, we're in the midst. We're trying to work that fight out. I'm trying to get that fight, Chase. Let's make it happen. That's right. Your jaw? That's right. Oh, my jaw? He had his jaw wired shut? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Manuel Newton can't win this black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a little too aggressive versus Emmanuel Newton. He was winning the fight. Yeah, I was definitely winning that fight. He was just rushing, whipping his ass, and he pulled the spinning back face, crashing. Funny thing was, is I went like later on in the hotel, like later on in the night, I was like, why the fuck didn't I go to the hospital? And my corner informed me, like, they tried to take you to the hospital, but you started flipping the lid and getting crazy in the back saying you didn't want to go to the hospital. I totally did not fucking remember that, so I definitely yeah. had a concussion. Yeah, uh, and then like a couple days later, he was with me in Vegas, and we, he, I took him to the Monster Cup, and he had his mouth all <laughs> wired shut, dude. <laughs> Yeah. No, no, no. Funny story. That that was like like four or five weeks later. Was it that long? Yeah, 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 yeah. I thought his so, mouth was wired shut. Oh, my mouth was wired shut. And by that time, I was like said, I was drinking still back in the day. I just said, fuck it. I took the rubber bands off the wires and started put, trying to put chicken wings in my mouth. <laughs> then I went to the doctor the next week and they're like, yeah, your mouth's completely fucked. You're going to need another three weeks. Damn it. So, you want me to tell the story or you want to tell the story when we first met? You did, funny, you tell it. You, you want me to tell? It? Yeah. So, okay, so so I met Joey. True story. This is yeah. about how long? 10 years ago? More than 10 years ago. Like 12, 12, 12, 12 years ago. It's before Triumph, so I, t I had a gym over here called Dojo Americana that I was doing with a, with a, with a, uh, a Brazilian black belt. Okay. We had this gym and he knew his old, his old coach, this guy named Frank like old school like boxing coach from the hood from the hood and 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 he goes hey um i got this guy that i want to fight he goes he goes he goes he came in and talked to mark and i he goes hey well will you guys will you guys beat him up like beat him up what do you mean he goes i'm gonna have him come in he's a wrestler i want i want i want you to put on i think it was little gloves too and i want you to just fucking beat him up like <laughs> what do you mean? He goes, I want to see, I want him to go through it. Okay, like, what is he going to do? And he goes, he's not going to do anything. He's just going to try to take you down. And so he comes in, and Joey was about like, he's like your size, dude. He's 300. Yeah, 300 yeah. pounds. Oh, shit. Yeah. Well, and, started, yeah. yeah, he was like, and he had long hair. Yeah. And, and, uh, and he came in, and he's all looking all Samoan. And, and, and I'm like, what, okay, what up? And he's like, because mm. he, he kind of knew what was about to go down. I'm like, we gloved up, and like, so I started touching him up a little bit. And his coach was like, no, fuck him up, fuck him up. <laughs> I'm like, no. And so I start, okay. I start hitting him harder and harder, and he, Joey just like, he starts walking at me, and I'm like, god damn, dude. And it got so bad that I'm like hitting him, hitting him. I was getting so tired, just I was like a punching bag, right? And I'm like, this fucking. Fucking nuts, dude! Like, <laughs> and that was it. And then now we we started we started working together right then. That's and I was he's been with me ever since. Like we've we've had a we've had a, our ups and downs and a back and forth. But like he's yeah. been with me through some through some like when I've had some shitty times and he's had some shitty times. Like yeah, he's been with me since I started that brand since I was a throw day, all of them. You know, yeah, that's Osiris, all of it. That's now we're old and we're sitting here doing this with you. Hell yeah, that's dope, though, homie. <laughs> 
Right? I always want to hit with my big knuckles. That's just the rule of thumb. Now, especially with bare knuckles, like if I hit straight or if I don't turn it over, and he's like just slightly moves his head, boom, and I hit my my pinky knuckles, I'm my my hand's fucked. Yeah. And even if it doesn't break, it's fucked for at least a couple minutes. I gotta shake yeah. it out and boom, keep my poker face throughout the fight. So just think, if I'm going straight, I'm going big knuckles. Even though on a hook, I want to collide with those knuckles. So just think about that, and same thing as far as where I'm hitting. <laughs> Big ass nuts. As, as far as where I'm hitting, boom. I want to hit in the nice soft area. What's the soft area? My All cheeks, the cheeks. My cheeks, the jaw, eyelids. Once we start getting above here, hard. With cocos, we don't want that. We don't want that noise. But even the ear, the ear's cool. Ear's cool? The uh, ear, because the ear will it'll hurt your hand, but it, it'll fuck him up in the equilibrium. Like the last guy I dropped, I, I hit him right there, boom, right above the ear. A couple, a couple fights ago, boom, right above the ear and dropped him. He got up and then I dropped him again. But he, uh, yeah, yeah, that 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 ear shot, that ear hole is money. Even like from from football, like they, they yeah, 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 ear hole, ear hole, motherfucker. Yeah. Same uh -huh. shit, same shit. Yeah. Good. Now we're gonna go jab. Nice and firm, smack that knuckle. Ah. And we're one, two. Five more. One, two, three, four, five. Nice and easy, but one, two, so one, two, body, make sure you get your bang. I'm more concerned right now as a coach of everybody's wrists, more so than my body, don't worry. So make sure we're placing that good. <laughs> See how he is fucking, he doesn't, he should be Don't hit the pad, hit my body. Don't hit the pad, hit my body. And I'll protect myself with the pad. Perfect. So, can I grip, can I grip? So, Slow it first, get, get your distance down. Go. Jab, cross, bend knees, and four. Yeah. Power shots for fucking three minutes. Whole joke. Whole joke. All right. Shh. All right. Reload, come with the uppercut. Reload, yep. Boom, boom. 
So this is so. Oh, okay. This thing. So you're gonna grab this, like uh -huh. this, like this. Cup it. Cup your hand. Oh. This is gonna come here, and then you're gonna push down. That's a push. Point. Which way? Which way am I pushing? So watch. Let me show you from this side. All right. So like this. So this needs to be further back. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, I'm already. Now, 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 that's it right here. Now this here, suck it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Like that? Yep. That's it. No, it's just soon. That's it. Oh, really? Oh yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah. That's it. Damn. Coming across. This is a, this is the, this <coughs> yeah, is the yeah, choke. Yeah. This, it, it, yeah. this is the choke that Khabib used on Connor. This comes in here. This right here, like this. This here, the blade right here. This goes here, the grip. That's it. And even if I fight, he fights it off. Done. Uh, That's it. Done. Uh, it's not. It's not a rear naked choke. It's called a fulcrum choke. Fulcrum choke. Fulcrum, yeah. Fulcrum. Uh -huh. Fulcrum. Okay. So Hans, I grab it here. Yep. So this this is positioned here. Yeah. The blades here. This hand over here with the gable grip. This try suck this into your right here. Suck this in, and that's it. And now push this down. Keep going. I'll tap. Like I'll this, tap. Like this. Like this. Look. Look. Like this. So, so watch. When you watch it, like, guys. Right, so when you do it, you're going like this. See it? Like that, that little. That's it. 